What is going on, my super sandwiches? Rob Sanger, Joe by Jaden Tasky for another Dragon Ball Xenos Reign of Battle. And today, we're going to go ahead and take a trip down memory lane with the best Dragon Ball games of all time. Now, the first question. Oh. And this is going to the, the feature question. So, when you answer this, I'm going to pick up a bunch of answers and then feature them at the end of my next wow. video in Xenos videos. What is your favorite Dragon Ball game of all time and why? Yikes. This is going to be a fun one. Oh, we'll start with Danny. Ooh. Uh, hello. Um, so... I've been going back and forth on this lately, and lately I've been saying that Xenoverse is actually my favorite Dragon Ball Z game. Mm -hmm. um, but, I mean, obviously, well, you know... Just, well, for the sake of not you know, using Xenoverse as an example, let's talk, let's talk about the old ones, like the nostalgic ones. The, I mean, if it's going to be the old ones, then it's definitely uh, Budokai Tenkaichi 3. I mean, Ooh, just, yeah, same here. No, I mean, you know, we used no, to be roommates. There's no question. There's no question. Um, I mean, it's obviously not the Raging Blast. It's obviously not Battle of Z. Uh, what, you like Metal Z? That's like the best game of all time. <laughs> I mean, if we want to go like way back in time, we could go back to like the first 2D Dragon Ball Z game that I ever played, which was uh, was a hyper. I think it was Hyper Dimension. I loved Hyper Dimension. Hyper Dimension. What was it? What was the other one? Uh, Super Platoon. Was it that? No, I feel on like there was Nintendo? another one. What? Hey, oh, wait, what, what no, console? it might have been. I think it was on PlayStation. Oh, uh, Ultimate Battle 22. No, Final Bout. Final Bout. That's what it was. Oh, Final, Final Bout. Bout. So Disgusting, dude. <laughs> I remember. So that game used to be ninety nine dollars because it was like super rare, super like under ship and stuff like that, and it, it just sold bad. So it was like a kind of like a cancel game. That game was like the most desired game back when you were in, my, in like, right? middle school, in middle school. Like the everyone first, wanted it. I remember the first time I played it was in fifth grade, and it came out like I got it before, like uh, you know, before I had even finished watching Dragon Ball Z, and so like uh -huh. there were Pan, like Pan was in it. And like all of these characters, like Boo was in it, and I'm like, who are these characters? <laughs> and I remember there was this Spanish kid in my class who was like, oh, that's Dragon Ball GT. And I'm like, what is? How do you? I was I was blown away. I was blown away. I like I had no idea. The funny thing with me is, is uh, it, the ironic part is, is Dragon Ball GT. It was the game, but it it had only Z characters essentially. Well, there were a couple of uh, GT characters in there, but for the most part, it, it was mostly like uh, Z characters in the GT game. Yeah. But overall, it was pretty bad. Oh my gosh, I just, just the memories, man. <laughs> I'm out of key, damn it. Or you're trying to like, like focus on fighting it, I'm like, walking down a trip memory lane. <laughs> uh, with me, I gotta go with, I gotta go with, uh, Tech IG3. Definitely Tech IG3. I mean, I remember the first time I played Budokai 1, how awesome it was. Cause that was like the first time we got a good Dragon Ball Z game. It yeah. wasn't like awful. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> gotta focus on fighting for a second. Uh, yikes! Oh no! Uh, let's go! Oh, let's no. go! Oh! Uh, <laughs> I, I, okay, I'll talk in a couple seconds. Let me just—that was so much damage. Let me just get this. Let me just get this fight in. Oh god! <laughs> no. Get out of here! Get no, out of no, here, no, Danny! No, no. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <sighs> what, what to do? 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 Oh yikes! Go. Oh god! This is so close! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! Oh wow! Nice. Woo. Oh. <laughs> Mike's about to say no. Tech H3 is the one <sighs> I played the most. Got really competitive. I mean, you live with me. You remember how intense it was of us just not talking to each other after a heated session, like right now. Um, <laughs> I mean, Xenoverse is probably my favorite game out of all of them, but I, I don't want to count that one just because it's the most recent one. We're just gonna go ahead and talk about the old ones. So if I had to pick the old one, Tech Ash 3 for me. We'll be right back. Now I'm sweaty. <laughs> what are you doing? Been watching cops. <laughs> just, 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 uh, watching cops. <laughs> <Just> cops. <laughs> uh, another good game that I really liked was Budokai 2, because it was like a massive improvement to Budokai 1, which obviously you know got the nostalgic factor. Budokai 3 was cool, but again, the one thing I never liked about the game was the Dragon Rush mode, because I felt like it was too automated. Like, once you go into Dragon Rush mode, it's basically rock paper scissors, and then yeah. if you can outguess your opponent, then you get the cool animation, and that's one thing I did not like about it, which is why I prefer Infinite World. Over that. Oh my gosh, I got Videl. Uh, <laughs> Videl's Videl good. Is, we know Videl's good. Actually, sh yeah, this is a decent one, so I can't really complain. Could beat that up. Beat that up. Maybe not. Okay, oh <laughs> I need to. I, I'm back to. Okay, so I'm not used to you doing the back attack because <laughs> you never didn't used to do it before. God damn it, you got me in that freaking combo again. Oh <laughs> gosh. Um, what was I saying? I'll say something. Uh, <laughs> I literally oh, yeah. I'm not, I'm not used to, I'm not used to doing the back attacks because you never used to do it before. Ugh! 
Wow, I'm, I'm so. Oh, it didn't hit. I was like, oh, snap, I hit that move. I never <laughs> hit that move. Freaking Fidel. Come here. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, Budokai 2. So, Budokai 2, what I like is, is it had the cell shaded improvement. You know, it had a lot of like cool moves, cool characters. Like, it was just overall a great game. Uh, but Tekaichi. Yikes. Tekaichi uh, 3 is what, you know, it had all the new characters, it had all the moves. It just It was just great. Great. Actually, you know what? Tekaichi 2 was even better. Well, I wouldn't say better because it was basically uh, the same game. It just Tekaichi 2 was just the improvement from, um, you know, Tekaichi 1 because that game was just bad. Oh my god, we don't talk about the first game. <laughs> true, true. Now I'm kind of trying to focus on this fight because, you know, you beat me the first time and I can't let you, like, yeet. <laughs> just, let me, just let me win. No, just, let me, just let me win, homie. Come on. Come on, bro. Yikes. Game. <laughs> oh, nice. Come here. You're like I can't throw. Oh, I can't throw key blast. Yikes! How are you gonna wait? How are you gonna throw key blast? Hawk charge! I wow! Punch you right in your tit. Cat fight. Cat fight. Hashtag tit punch in the comment section below. <laughs> we'll be right back with the next one. So let's actually talk about Xenoverse for a second because, like I said, Xenoverse is my favorite game because obviously it's not the best game to a lot of people, but to me, as a fan, what I want out of the series, this game delivers. And I love the direction that Bandai took with this game. I just I love it. It's just a lot of fun and. It's funny, I remember when this game, oh my god, I saw who I got. <laughs> Is that a good thing or a bad thing or... Oh, great. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> um, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, I mean, especially since when they... The thing that sold me the most on it, I think, was... Uh, well, obviously they created a character because everyone's been wanting that for, you know, years. Um, but the fact that they tried to take a different route with the, the storyline. Can I even snap vanish? I don't know. Oh, I can't. Yeah, uh, yeah. I can just, I'm just gonna troll you the entire match, because that's all I can really just do with this character. Hello? Yeah, come here. Ah, Got him. Come on, don't. <laughs> what? Where? What? <laughs> Why? That's <laughs> all I can really do with this character. It's, he's so bad. Gosh. He's Tiny Boo. Got him. Uh, okay, well, that, that one, that didn't, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We'll be right back with the real round, the for real this round. <laughs> oh, that counts. Uh, oh, 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 it just counts. <laughs> Fine, you can have this win. I hate you. We'll be right back. <laughs> Alrighty, so yeah, uh, let's talk about Zeros for a second. For real this time, and actually focus on it. <laughs> like I said, the thing I like about this is it, it gave us a little bit of everything. Obviously, it didn't give us everything, because you can't make every single Dragon Ball fan happy, but it added a custom created characters the right way. It had a new fight system. And the thing that I love about Dragon Ball games all times, oh my god, I just saw who I got. Is it Baby Boo again? Or no, it's worse. Or? It's worse. Worse for you. Oh, great. Yeah. Not if, we, not if body. body change. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it, it, it kind of gave you a little bit of everything, and that's a cool thing about it. So I love the old games, but I also love where the future is going. So that's kind of the cool thing. Um, so I guess the people who have been playing this game lately, I guess let us know your thoughts. Playing it, we've been playing it a ton. It's funny, because I remember when I was uh, first making videos about this game, you know, back in 2014, I was always saying, I was like, yo, this is a game I'm going to play until, like, for two years. And a lot of people <laughs> always be like, no, you're not. There's no way. This game's going to suck. Am I still playing it? In your face. <laughs> In your face, people from 2014. Yeah. <laughs> can you freeze? No. Can you not do that? <laughs> Gosh. Hey, at least it's not the, 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 the godly build, so be happy. It doesn't even make sense that this Frieza's Race character would have it when none of the other... What, like, Frieza doesn't even have it. <laughs> that, that's funny. Great. Uh, <laughs> oh, God, that's so evil. Uh, get up! I feel like this is a good balance for what happened last time. Why don't you still beat me? <laughs> <laughs> Come here. Hey, put it this way. At least you'll be ready for Xenoverse 2. We fought so much, like, you you sucked, like, literally, you know, two weeks ago. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I should've just fired this at you. <sighs> oh, God, I was, uh, scratching my nose. I, okay, I need to actually take this serious because I am, like, getting my ass beat now. <laughs> Let's do this. No! <laughs> oh, that. yikes. Oh, you have that attack? <laughs> yeah. This is my Frieza build. Uh, I did we? I used this against you a couple of oh, weeks ago, didn't I? I don't remember. Get out of here! Dang it! <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Oh, I didn't finish you off. I thought I got to finish off yeah. the slicer. No. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Great. 
I froze you to death. Stupid Ginyu. I froze you to death. It's okay. We'll do one more. I think we're tied up, are we? Two and two? It might be. I don't know. Next round. Next round. So the old games are great, and obviously I love the future. So again, let us know in the comment section below what was your favorite old drama games of all time and why. Don't what do you think, what say, do you think about the uh, what do you think about the Game Boy games? Wait, wait, wait. Don't say Budokai. Don't say, there's always people who just they answer the comment but they don't say why. Like we wanna know why. What is it about the games that you liked? So <laughs> add, uh, add to it. Uh, wow, Danny, that was so rude burping into the mic. Oh cool. Oh wow. This is a good way to finish it. The Game Boy games, I liked. Uh, Legacy Goku, I remember the first time I got Legacy Goku, and that was like my first Dragon Ball game after like Budokai. I was excited. It I wasn't like a they good were, game. they were so unnecessarily difficult. Yeah, right? You fight like a bear and end up getting killed. It's like you're Goku over here. <laughs> Let's see, what can yeah, I do here? Get it, get it. <laughs> Stop, what? Yeah, I beat you my stick. I beat you my stick. Strike Revelation! Why does it go, go so far ahead? Oh gosh. I gotta keep an eye. I, I, I can't mess around with you. I, I keep like, part of me just keeps doing this like a cocky thing where I just try to like, you know, play with you because I still feel like I'm superior to you and like you're like obviously <laughs> oh, evil cool, now. Man. And I, I need to stop doing that because it doesn't work out for me that well. Look, like, look how intense this is. And you're Whis. Oh yeah. Yay. Oh damn it. Wow. Ha, dork. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Hey, I'm Whis. Damn it. Oh god, did that attack ever hit? I feel like that attack is so like, I don't know. It's not properly like built. Yeah, he gotcha, 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 no, gotcha. No, no. Ooh. Yeah. So yeah, as I was saying, in the comments below, say which game was better, uh, which was your favorite, and oh god. That was kinda close. Dude, Whis is literally like dancing in the air. I cannot wait for Xenoverse 2. I, I need the game on the body. Like, I think it's gonna be it's gonna be the new favorite. <laughs> that we're gonna play for the next two years. <laughs> like literally. I look. I, I'll say this. I know a few things about the game, and I'm not gonna spoil it because obviously I can't. And I gotta say, you know, I'll tell you this. Not everything's gonna be added in that people are like, you know, hoping to to see. But there's gonna be enough added in to you're gonna be satisfied. As a drama fan, you will be satisfied. That's all I'm gonna say. I mean, they always leave me satisfied and smiling. Just like your mom. <laughs> Wow, oh. guy. Oh. Wow, guy. Can you not just back up? <laughs> you're literally, oh, you're the literally Kagi right now. No, Kagi flies in circles. Yep, that's you. Kagi just literally flies in circles. Like, I'm gonna, see, like right now, I'm, I'm back to my cocky attitude. Because I just want to beat you with like this move. No, 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 not that one, not that, not that one. Damn it. That's, that's three key bars wasted. Oh, okay, great, fantastic. <sighs> I'm just going to kill you, screw it. Because I'm obviously, if I, if I try to... If I try to like you know be fancy, I'm gonna lose. Don't How did I miss? How go. did I miss? Because with Whis, I always feel it's necessary to beat someone with the karate chop because it's like you know it adds to the effect. But screw it, that, that's gonna cost you're me a lag a, switcher. A game. Hey, I, I says the guy you in with the three face. bars. I punched you in the face. Uh huh. I didn't see it. Uh huh. I didn't see it. Ladies and gentlemen, let us know what your favorite Dragon Ball games of all time and why, not including Xenoverse. If you like Xenoverse, feel free to say that too, but also say the older games too. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like. If you're hyped for Xenoverse 2, punch the like button as well, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.